Hello, hello, beautiful people. Welcome back to another Old School RuneScape Leagues video. In the previous video, we ended up getting to 10,555 League Points. We're currently rank 50 or 60, somewhere in there. This video's goal is going to be just pushing as close to the next tier as possible. That is pretty much the plan. <laughs> and uh, let's just uh, continue on doing tasks. We just got a Pro Tips Fragment. Let's take a look at what it does. We receive more Bolt Tips per gem. And it could be, yes, it is the Craftsman. So. So basically, I can have activate my craftsman now and it will make everything in one tick. So let's just go ahead and put it into use. Okay, let's test it. Yeah, it works. That's what I mean. Okay, so 50 maple longbows completed. All right, it is time for some corrupted gauntlet. We're going with full absolute unit and a little bit of knife's edge. Let's see if we can get some good runs in. Oh, crystal impling. Yoink. Two dragon daggers. I'll take it. Master combat achievement. Defense doesn't matter. Oh, because I didn't grab any armor. We'll take it. Look at this loot. Five rune full helms, three rune plate legs. There we go. I think that's gonna be one of the speedruns. Just not insane speedrun just yet. Three to one mage, 250 league points, corrupted speed chaser, corrupted speedrunner. Wait, did I do it? I did it under seven minutes on my third attempt. Wow, look how many tasks we just got. We just bumped up a lot of ranks as well. What a run. Nice. Let's get a nice little reward for that attempt. Hey, we're rich. Look at the rune stuff. Bro, this is great. Let's keep it going for a little bit. I'm excited. This is fun. New personal best, 617. And we just got two rune chain bodies, a couple of dragon arrows, and more shards. All right, pretty good run. Uh, diamonds, blood runes, and emeralds. Look, look at that. That's amazing. Free crafting XP right there. 544. That's like a 40 second increase straight away. That's really good. I'm proud of that. That's nice. Okay, okay. I, I know what to do now. I fully get it. Rubies, sapphires, nice amount of crafting XP. We'll take it. Right, since we almost did corrupted in five minutes, let's try a normal one in five minutes. <laughs> I didn't cook my fish. <laughs> oh no. We go again. We go again. I got a flyer. <laughs> Get your bases from Iowa's bases. Okay, anyways, we go again. We go again. I got some tasks done. 530. Pretty bad setup. I don't need that much food for a regular gauntlet. I got some mithril arrows. <laughs> All right, then let's do it one more time. This one's the one. Oh, nice. 446. Good, good, good. There we go. Uh, another big pointer. So those are all the tasks I needed for the regular one. Okay, enough corrupted for one day's work. We'll definitely be coming back every now and again to uh, get more rotten tomatoes. Uh, that was a lot of fun, a lot of improvement. Uh, but, you know, there's that much attention spent that I have. However, would you look at our inventory? We have so many items we can alk for a ton of profit. Let's go ahead and do that and then start working on some crafting so we can make this into a fury. So thanks to the success with the corrupted gauntlet or regular gauntlet, and some rotten tomatoes. We are now rank 48 league points, so doing pretty good. Tando Emprentis. Uh, let's take a look at what this gives, actually. If we're making, like, amulets or rings or stuff like that, we can get, like, double. Nice. Okay, not too bad. Let's utilize all the uncuts we just got from the gauntlet and get some free crafting XP. That is 53. That is 55. Make that 56. 57, 58, and we are done. Nice amount of levels very quickly. Oh, we got a relic. Rupple bow string. Okay, nothing crazy. 70 crafting coming in strong. All right, let's finish it off with a battle staff. There it is, 82 crafting. Not quite 90, but you know the relics. We can get a plus 8 boost and make ourselves an onyx. Already an onyx. That is amazing. While I was doing my charters, I also realized there's a rabbit on the menu. Yep, there it is. Let's also eat it. Totally normal thing to do. So there we go. We make an onyx amulet unfinished we add a ball of wool to that we wear that i believe that is a task oh just crafting an onyx amulet is 125 points very very nice and then if i unequip this and if i charge it we already have an amulet of fury on leagues trying to complete every single possible task at the moment one is to craft a dragonstone amulet basically a glory and let's also enchant it because you know uh teleporting with the glory might be useful i might chuck it in my house as well charging a quick glory should be a task beautiful entering the guild is also a task and i forgot to create 100 unpowered orbs just entering the myths guild it's some free points okay so first of all here is what we're doing make sure we make one at a time we're gonna make a body we're gonna make some legs we're gonna make some chops we're gonna do the same thing with the blue stuff so chops i didn't click one did i 
Ah, it's fine. I have more blue ones. The only problem is I might need to go kill more blue dragons because I need to do 30 bodies as well. How did I get scammed like that? That's just a straight up scam. That's just not fair. And then obviously this one, we gotta make chaps as well. And now would you look at that? Boom. Equip full black dragon set. Check. Equip full blue dragon set. Check. Red dragon set. Also check. So there it is. That gave me a ton of points, a ton of sages renown. And from here, just gonna do all and on blue dehyde bodies. Nice. I ended up not getting finessed and that is craft 30. 30 blue bodies also done nice let's do one more let's catch the simply nice sharks and i guess i'm gonna go ahead and do the 100 unpowered orbs as well hey okay, there it is unpowered orbs completed simple task quickly chopping a magic lock right over here apparently there's a task to equip mithril gloves as well totally missed that but that's a free one all right let's take a look if i make myself an air orb chuck it onto the staff yep that does it 50 points just like so that's 25 -er. from now on i'm basically doing magic slash redwood all the way throughout so that was a 50 pointer well that's a willow shield speed running through the entire game to just complete the most random tasks that's a you short bow thank you dagon of kings only cost me 25 renown points and i have 72 so i have points to spend so let's just get into it dk's unlocked when it comes to my relics i'm gonna be choosing absolute unit to reflect some damage arcane conduit to save me some runes and praying respects to bury my bones so hopefully i can do it with this gear i mean i have a fury that's kind of sick but everything else is really bad okay no people inside the first kill might be the hardest so let's just see how it goes i guess i feel like with msb i mean i have 96 range i think i should be fine killing the big chunker what are we looking at ring of life oh no straight away ring of life you know what let's no nah, i don't want to wear it i don't want to wear it because if i get low it's gonna tp me fuck it we wear it oh i got something oh not just killing all three without leaving all right that will take it an identified fragment for combat and it's from a boss this is another thing that i forgot to mention but this could be an amazing way to get really good fragments let's take a look special Special discount. That's one of the big ones. I believe you get uh, special restoration faster. <gasps> yes! Berserker ring straight away. Let's go! This is the best ring we wanted. Boom! 50 points. Nice, nice, nice. Very cool. We'll take that. Thank you very much, game. Oh, Archer Helm. That's a new one. Ran out of ammo. I thought that it would last me a bit longer. But I guess I didn't have the relic that saves my ammunition. So it kind of makes sense it ran out. Let's do something else. We ended up getting B-ring, which is a pretty nice upgrade. Uh, but nothing beyond that. So I'll definitely be returning. Oh! Never mind. Two rune crossbows. We'll take that. Lol. I misclicked, teleported to the wilderness, killed the crazy archaeologist, got a rune crossbow. Life is not bad right now. We'll take it. We will take that. Thank you. Okay, so if I go assignment... Oh, that's apparently a task itself. Dust devils. That's what I want to do right now. I actually just got dust battle stuff. That's huge. That's a task. Look. Boom. We take those. Very nice. Oh, and there's another one for equipping a battle stuff or some... Wow. Nice. We just got 98 magic. One more level to go. That is 70 Slayer. Now, as soon as I enter the Releka Slayer Cave, I can do all the tasks there for a ton of points. So I guess I'll do that after I do this for a little bit longer. Enough Slayer for now. We're up to 70. Slayer task is completed. Let's go do some tasks. Cockatrice. Defeated. Pyrefint. Done. Defeated Jelly. That is Turoth. Done. And that is every single monster defeated. Oh, Master of Broad Weaponry as well. And defeat a Kurask. There we go. Nice. Dwarf Cannon done. I can now purchase a Dwarf Multi Cannon. That's gonna be useful because we gotta grind some Slayer points. So that's a task. In playing time. Rune darts. Honestly, not bad. This is where I'm gonna spend a little bit of time mining. And I have a deposit box right here, right next to the mine spot. So this should be absolutely insane. That is 60 smithing as well. Time for some cannonballs. And usually this will take forever, but not in leagues. Look at this. Yeah. Hello. There we go. Boom. Nice. We'll make a ton of these. 1,570 cannonballs is what we're left with. It seems pretty reasonable and pretty good. However, I'm quickly gonna mine more mithril in order to get 100 bars so I can smith those into dart tips for points so let's go ahead and do that we're about to reach a big level 70 mining meaning i can also mine 50 adamant ore which is also a task and it should be a quick one because i get three ores every time i mine we now have 100 mithril bars let's go and smith those in oh actually i'm not gonna smith them yet let's mine 50 adamant first just so i don't need to constantly switch out the relics and then we're gonna make those into dart tips mine 50 adamant ore that was actually extremely quick yeah there's a thousand mithril darts smith Okay, so I've never done this before, but I have a crystal armor seed, and there's a task to make something. Apparently, with one, you can only make the helmet, so I'm just gonna make the helmet. This will consume your armor seed as well as crystal shards. Sure, how many? 50. Nice amount of XP, though. Look at that. Beautiful stuff. How much for a shield? 750 million. Yeah, I'll take it. There we go. I got a crystal shield. Did I get scammed? Probably. Did I get a task completion? Yes, I did. So it was worth it. Nice. So I guess we'll be killing the spiders here until we run out of cannonballs. It might take us a little bit of time, but we should be getting a ton of points. I got 99 hit points. I 
kind of forgot that was coming actually i'm not gonna lie done with the wildy slayer for now i'm out of cannonballs i ended up getting two laran keys we're gonna open those and 495 slayer tasks i think that should be enough for what i need all right let's see what we got two keys if i get dagon high would happen dragon arrows not ideal but we got a task done regardless and renar seeds you know what these are gonna come in handy Nice. Apparently, that's a task as well, taking it from Duradel, but let's see. Cave Horrors. I want to do some Cave Horrors. That's a lot of them. I'm going to do them with melee, just so to train my melee stats up a little bit. And uh, yeah, let's get a Black Mask. All right, so here's the thing. We have 495 points, okay? We're going to unlock Hot Stuff because we want to get a Jad task when we do that. So there we go. That's a no-brainer. Uh, we're also going to unlock Bigger and Better because that's a task. And we are not going to worry about the Slayer Helm because it's a lot of points. And I can just imbue my Black Mask, which is what I'm going to do for my Jad task. So let's just go ahead and... And, uh, get that done. I got one kill. I got one kill. One kill. First kill count. I got a black mask. I wasn't even recording. Well, let's just wear it, I guess. That's definitely a skip. Like 200 of them. We just got a mask. We're good to go. Boom. There it is. Nice. Black mask imbued. We can now range Jad. Let's get at it. There we go. Thank you. Hit. Just gonna hit to full now. And now we just kill it. There we go. Jad completed. I got three Slayer levels. And most importantly, we have the Fire K. But look at this. We got a combat fragment from the Jad. Let's wear the Fire K. That's probably a task. Uh, yeah, it was. Look how many points we just got. A lot. And then let's check what we got. Nothing. It's a disaster. Uh, but now, you know, it was fun having this K. But let's immediately sacrifice it. And that is one, two, five points. Thank you. There it is. Pickpocket a diamond from Tazar. One, two, five points. Look how close we are to tier seven. Now, beautiful. So right now, I'm gonna have some help from leech ba and we're pretty much gonna grind out the entirety of the tasks when it comes to ba pretty much so this is the first one defeating the penis queen and obviously we still need to get torso and level five in every role let me get torso real quick because that's a free task we buy that then we wear that and that's one task nice 50 that's number two that is number three absolute legends okay okay there we go we are now fully done 1.4k on every roll let's go unlock everything and enjoy ourselves some points we have enough points so we just gotta level up everything yeah that's the first task and now i need to get all of the rolls to tier five okay and there we go and that is tier five in every single roll one to five points we're getting dangerously close to the next level and i had so much time to think about my next task that i have a full list that i want to just smash out and then log the last tier right now that was actually a task we'll take it 25 as well what? construction level boom stash unit that is now the zamorak completed as well meaning one more to go and that is sarah Doman. let's get it done fast all the spells unlocked now i just have to find the player to cast every single spell on apparently it can be a mob so let's just go ahead and do that that's one that's two and that would be three we'll take the points thank you very much that match just kidding see yeah, idiot there we go that's two zero and then hopefully the last one is like nearby because i don't have many supplies left that was easy found him in uh, half a second and uh, we're done Woo. okay here we go here we go ladies and gentlemen couple of minutes that's all it took. And we now have an imbued uh, Zamorak cape. Boom. Big. My favorite. Nice. Uh, more tasks to come. Let's go. Bro, I got 100 watermelons from one patch. How many? I got three levels from one patch. 120. 123. Please tell me it's like bugged or something. No, man. 130 watermelons. I think I can clean this. Yep. Time for mining and smithing again. I want to get to 80 smithing with a plus 8 boost. So think of it 72 smithing and then I can do a couple of more tasks. All right, a nice little AFK session at the rocks and we are now 77 mining, meaning that with plus 8 boost I can mine runite ores. So there's the first milestone, 72 smithing. There we go. We can create enhanced crystal key. Okay, so I could get something good here maybe. Dragonstone with some coins and I I can turn this into glories. Uh, nice little 50 points. This chest here is also a task, I believe. Nice. Oh, I found one. This is huge. Come on. I just hope it creates a bar. I just needed to create a bar and we're good. Oh, <gasps> nice. Well, look at that. We mine Runor and we create a bar. Oh, it's beautiful. That's so many points for free. Okay, finally done with the birdhouse situation right now. Thank you, game. Nice, potato. Hey, 25. We'll take it. Please tell me this works. There we go. Ooh, nice. Should give me a task if I make a four dose. There we go. Nice medium one as well. If I'm not mistaken, this should be a couple of tasks actually. Or just one, and then if I make some more... I guess it is just one task for now, because I need to make 50. But I'm gonna first off test the crystal memories for the very first time. So obviously I'm using Delay Essence, giving me a little bit extra XP. I'm also probably gonna go to Zia Mine a bit. And I can just do this, 
teleport right back and that will be now the task completed beautiful look we're so close 700 points away 20 nuggets obtained 695 points to go 25 more for unlocking free blast furnace just did a little bit of blast mine and if i'm not mistaken that is a rune ore and that is an addy ore and that's 54 in adamant and that's 79 mining and that should be a 125 for a rune super easy 125 task honestly that is a gargoyle in mauritania defeated thank you wyvern done and 360 to go that is blood Veld for 50 points 310 to go 25 extra points nice nice okay selling my gems to this little man for a red topaz machete that i can then wield for a beautiful task of 50 and i think if i also buy all of the tribal stuff and there it is another 25 we'll take it so i just noticed on twitter that they are going to update the amount it costs to unlock certain bosses and just because of that and just because we are so damn close to basically the last tier i'm just gonna unlock one that's gonna be very very easy to complete and that is to just simply kill a calfite queen it's a one two five point task i have a lot of renown to spend and i'm totally okay spending 30 points to get 125 back so calfite queen let's make sure we unlock it there it is and now i'm gonna grab my range gear with an absolute tank fragment and we're gonna go kill it quickly there it is 125 and i have an exact idea of what i want to do to finish off well the last six basically i could do something boring but you know what we are so close to 99 magic i think it is only suitable we return to the monkeys where it all began and there it is i'm gonna teleport out we unlocked the final the last year our full strength look at that the fragments i can put one more in oh my god i've been waiting for this moment for pretty much the entire day today the second part of the video was pretty much just uh, quite a bit of a grind for me because i really wanted to reach this because i know for a fact that from now it's just gonna be so exciting uh but anyways let's see what did we just get we unlocked the larger recharger let's quickly take a look at what that is it's probably one of the late game ones and it faster special attack restoration what about special discount special attack cost reduction oh shit so faster restoration and the cost reduction combine these together and you probably get a really nice uh, setup but anyways we'll dive deeper into those in my next episode for now i just really hope you guys did enjoy this video if you did if you made it this far consider giving me a like and uh, I'm gonna go ahead and uh, get 99 fishing and cooking now while I chill and relax and enjoy my full power of the relics. Anyways, have a good one everyone. See you again tomorrow with another video and stay safe. Bye-bye.